I made a dumb mistake and now we're fixing it. So <laughs> we're finishing up this landscape job and about to be out of here off to the next job. And the customer thought that, I don't talk anything about my actual customers. I'm just saying in general, the customer thought we were doing a weed barrier fabric underneath all the front garden beds before putting the mulch down. And, and uh, I'm sure the customer said it. Somehow it slipped my mind. I didn't put it on the work order, the contract, the job description. I was like, didn't think anything of it. And um, so now we're raking very carefully all the mulch to one side and in piles. And then now we're installing all the fabric, then putting the mulch onto the fabric. And then where the mulch is contacting the dirt, the thin layer, we're raking all that up and discarding it. And then we're going to put fabric and we're going to have to go get a little bit more mulch. This will probably take us two and a half hours to fix this. And uh, it could be way worse, right? Not even a big deal. It's just two garden beds that need fabric and mulch. But here's what I learned. Here's what I learned. When you make a mistake, anybody can make that mistake. How do you respond? Sure, it can feel like a pit in your stomach. It can feel like your stomach is turning. Now, we could have installed an entire patio and it's the wrong color brick or installed an entire retaining wall and it was something totally wrong and you got to rip it up and redo it. I hear stories like that in our landscape community. I'm like, whoa. Stan Genetic talks about how he got ripped off for an 80, exactly, for an $80,000 retaining wall and never got paid. This is two and a half hours. Not a big deal. But how do you respond? It's like... uh I've learned over the years, and I'm not great at this, give yourself an hour to be upset about it and say, okay, let's just fix it. The faster you get over it and just get the thing fixed right and as quickly as possible is the faster you can move on to the next job and make money. For instance, if you've got a cu customer that rips you off for a few hundred bucks, <clears throat> of course you can keep sending them invoices and stuff like that. But I think that if you let it take you down and and you, you obsess over it, all of that mental time and energy and bandwidth is being wasted where you could have just been on another job making money. So it's like the dips, you get what I'm saying? So next time something like that happens to you or you make a dumb mistake, just fix it as quickly as possible and do it right and move on to the next thing. And um, that's just what happens when you're running a service business. And it's not even a big deal. We're fixing it. Two and a half hours. We're going to be on in the next job right after this. Yesterday, I was like, I was so pissed off at myself. Because when you're walking a property with a customer, you um, there's a million questions you can ask and things you can cross every T and dot every I and still miss things. It's just, it just happens. But luckily, this is not any big deal let's i gotta go because i we're, we're we gotta we, oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah i forgot i forgot my 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 how to start a landscaping business video training course if you're trying to get your business off the ground or you're in your first year of your business you want to know how to go legit how much should you pay yourself uh license insurance taxes registering your business quoting property walks pricing the entire lowdown about your landscaping business and avoiding tons of costly mistakes my updated and revised landscaping course is now live and it's really 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 good stuff i'll put it in the link in the description below this video look for you know how to start a landscaping business course and click on it and buy that course i promise you if you're new in the business or you're trying to get started this will equip you with so much knowledge and information that it will literally pay for itself over and over and over for years to come i promise you that it's really really good so get my how to start a landscaping business video course and as soon as you dive in you'll love it and i also have the trainings on mp3 as well so you can download and listen to them while you work all right i want to hit the subscribe button